close the Bible and do not study further. The Bible warns, study to show that self approved unto God. A workman that needed not to be ashamed, rightly divided the word of truth. Second Timothy 2.15 The digital age has given room for more knowledge at our fingertips. We can decide to study the scripture, read, read books, biographies, and watch online programs, etc. On our mobile devices, such as phones, tablets, laptops, etc., in a world that is, a, that is fast advancing in wickedness, Christians need to study and meditate deeply on God's word to know him better, to be able to remain in his love. The only way we can know God better is by reading his word, getting closer to God, knowing God, doing the things of God, doing the will of God, all still bounce back to reading his word. When we don't read his word, there is no how we can do the things of God. There is no how we can know what God wants. There is no how we can do the will of God. And reading his word and doing his will will make us to know him better. So let's read on. In a world that is fast advancing, okay. Study, meditate, okay. In a world that is fast advancing in wickedness, Christians need to study and meditate deeply in God's word to know Him better, to be able to remain in His love. In the last days, the Bible says that the love of many shall wax cold. It's already happening. For our love not to wax cold, we need to hold on tight to God's word. The constant reminder of who God is is of who God is, the depth the depth of his love and his promises through his word has the unlimited power to sustain us in these evil days. Through this, we obey the scripture by loving God with all our hearts. How can it all fit together? A certain man of God wrote, God has made us with the harmony of heart and head and thoughts and action. The more we know him, the more we love him, and the more we seek him to know him. To be central in our hearts, he must be foremost in our minds unless we keep growing and renewing our minds through God's word will be the Christian versions of the Samaritans to whom Jesus said, Ye worship ye know what ye worship ye know not what. We know what we worship for salvation is of the Jews. John four twenty two. Beloved, be ready to learn and love God the more. May God help us in the name of Jesus. May God help us to, you know, to, just like yesterday, he said, the one of the prayers said, we should be the, um, the, uh, the doer, the hearer of his word and the doer of his word. That God should make us not just the hearer of his word, but may we also be the doer of his word. I'm trying to share this. May we also be, if coming, if you're Hebrew. Okay. If you are Hebrew. May we also be the era of his word. Okay, how do I share this? Okay, post. I'm almost rounding up though. I just want to share anyways. I'm rounding up very, very soon. 
So I'm going to run through 